Peace. I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes, and I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise. Today we got a really quick and random message, and this one's gonna be for Pisces. Pisces, let's get it. Pisces, what is the message, boo? Let's go. Pisces. Ooh, judgment. So I feel like you're going through an awakening, or you're you've uh, been summoned to take an action or to make uh, to make a decision. Is what I heard. Okay. I'm also getting that someone's going to call you. It looks like it's going to be an Aries. Okay. I feel like an Aries is going to call you. I feel like they, they miss you. They, 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 they've been thinking a lot about you. They could be text messaging you if they don't call you. I'm also getting that you're making a decision to move back home. This could be with your family member or in your hometown. I feel like that's the best, that's the best decision for you to, to make. I feel like your finances will improve and you have a lot of support back home. I'm also getting that you are, you're going to get some really, 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 really good news, but you're going to have to hold your composure. Okay. Like, I feel like this, this type of good news is going to like, make you good, like want to react in a, in a way that shouldn't be reacting. I feel like it's just like, it's like one of those things you have to compress. Like, okay, I'm so happy right now. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Like that, like just compose yourself. Okay. But judgment card here. Can you tell me why the judgment card is here, please? Yeah. Um, eight of cups. Yeah. So you're moving in the right direction and yeah, or you're moving home. Six of, six of cups. You're going, your child could be coming home. I'm also getting something about your child is being called home. Hold the hell on. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, so okay, so you could have lost a child. I know that's a, a lot to take in, but they're being called home. They're what God, judgment card. They're what God. I'm also getting something about like um, astral projecting. Okay, you may have, I, I, okay, so I'm also getting, if you like meditate, I feel like you've seen someone that passed away. <laughs> or you may feel like you've seen God. <laughs> or, okay, I heard the ethers. Wow. No, I was in the ethers. I was in space is what I just heard. Okay. Pisces, you rule the ethers, though. So I feel like you're really in your mind on a spiritual journey in your mind. I feel like you're going down like uh, you're, you're, you're actually projecting to your childhood or, or an age when you were six or eight. I feel like you hold on a memory from that particular time. You could be just astral projecting and seeing children, seeing a family. You have no clue like who these these people are, but I feel like that's where you are. Or it, it, I feel like this actual projection is taking you to a past life. This is deep. But on a mundane level, you've been called, you've been summoned to make a decision. You've been called to move on or let something go or stop living in the past. Let something go. Let those feelings go. Okay, stop isolating yourself. Stop being sad or depressed or stop holding on to grief and pain, either from someone you lost or a relationship. Put your mind to peace. The worst is over or like, like you need peace in your life. I'm also getting because you suffer with some type of like anxiety or depression or a lot of grief and pain, you're not accepting what's being given to you. I'm also getting that you're you you're you're going down memory lane. Possibly, I feel like some of you guys are you have a memory of being like sexually abused, raped, or something like that. Or you could be having these type of dreams, rape dreams, or something like that. Or some I don't know.
It's because it's like it's like you need to free yourself from something. If something is deep in your subconscious. And it's like an obstacle to get over it or to get past it. Six of Swords in reverse. Three of Cups. But I feel like, I really feel like this just has a lot to do with childhood trauma, okay? Or past trauma, relationship trauma. I don't know. But I see I see you trying to... to I see you trying to let go, trying really hard, but okay. So I feel like when you do come to like um, a mental breakthrough, like I feel like you're going to seize an opportunity. You're going to, you're going to experience being free or you're going to experience a lot of opportunities to coming to you because you broke free from a, um, from like some type of mental incarceration. Yeah. You like literally just snap. Someone here is, um, someone's child looks like they are going to go away to jail, probably for like six, four to six years, okay? But I heard, I heard you say I, it's better in jail than in these streets, so that's for someone specific. This could be someone's baby father. Anything else to say to Pisces? Yeah, three of cups. So if someone is a three of pentacles, excuse me, in reverse, if someone is going to um, jail, I, I really feel like it's because they didn't learn from their past mistakes. Okay. They will be doing a little bit of time. You will be out here doing this on your own. You may not have a lot of support, but you'll get through it. Others of you, this person has already served their time. They'll be coming home, but the relationship won't work. It won't work. So I would try to move past that if you, this is what you're thinking, getting back with this person. Okay, I would be very hesitant before you take this opportunity. Okay, because I feel like you've already been free from this. And the solution is to move forward with whatever it is that you've been doing. Okay, for real. That's what I got for you.